New at noon, Webster County is getting ready to host its sixth annual Martin Luther King Day event on Monday, and folks can look forward to lots of activities that day. And joining us live to tell us more about this event is James Townsend, the Webster County MOK Planning Committee Chairman. How are you doing? Fine, I'm good. That is great. So tell us about um, the event that is happening on Monday because this is the sixth annual. Yes, ma'am, I certainly will. Um, in fact, we're starting at 12 noon at the 855 Dunn Street and we're going to gather there with the marchers and our parade and our uh, motorcade. Those that want to join in the uh, Freedom Marches, they can come in their POV and uh, ride along with us. So we're going to have the Uport Police Department escorting us there. We're going to have a fantastic time. We're going down to the Cross of Christ on the um, uh, the intersection of 82 in uh, Veterans Memorial Boulevard there, and we're going to have a fantastic time. We're going to leave there and go to the Uporo Civic Center mm -hmm. at uh, 2135 um, Rhone Avenue. We're going to have a fantastic time there. And following that, at 5.30, we're going out to our wonderful White Creeks Lake and have a, a, a fantastic time with a fire work show out there, an uh, exposition out there, and we're going to have a fantastic time there as well. All right, sounds like a fantastic day on tap there. So what is the message that you want people to take away by coming to Eupora and seeing the folks there gather in memory and honor of Dr. King? Abs uh, absolutely. We're trying to keep the dream alive. Dr. King did a lot of things for us to pay the way for all of us to have the freedoms that we all enjoy right now. And so we're trying to unify the communities, surrounding communities, to come in and join with us on this uh, positive effort. We're loving people and we should out in people's, uh, peaceful ways to join and get people to come together for a positive effort. Okay, and of course, um, the weather's going to be a little bit colder. Do you have like an alternative plan? Absolutely, absolutely. Now, you, uh, common sense to you a lot of things. This is raining and pouring down there. We're gonna, not going to be out there, but nevertheless, we have uh, a civic center there, mm -hmm. and we're going to come down there and start the program there and carry on. It's just, it's just like it never happened. We're going to go <laughs> on. Yes, ma'am. All right, then. Well, thank you so much, there, James Townsend, for joining us this afternoon. Well, if you like.